Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. As you can see here, I have with me McKenna Riley and JJ Carter. And I am going to be changing both of these guys here for you. First, I'm going to start with JJ and then I'm going to change Miss McKenna here. So let's get started. For JJ, I have this um, Sesame Street outfit. And if you watched a previous video or maybe a couple of videos back that I uploaded, I changed <clears throat> um, Braxton into a Sesame Street outfit as well. This is the other set, so they'll kind of be matching. And I will show you McKenna's outfit once I get there. But. Let's go ahead and let me get this upload. I can actually reach. Okay, here we go. Let's put this blanket here. So you guys can see. Oh, yeah, the big boy. See if I can get you guys angled a little bit. There you go. So you can still see both babies. Make sure his head's kind of. There you go. All right. This cute little man. Uh, if you didn't watch JJ's box opening, you guys can hit pause in this video and come back to it if you wish. Um, he came with this um, swaddler. It's by Blankets and Beyond, if you are wondering. And Maxwell also has a Blankets and Beyond swaddler. But here was JJ's outfit that I had changed him in not too long ago. Um, I just think it's so cute. It's a Mickey Mouse theme. And I'm thinking I want to get a lot of Mickey Mouse things for him. Also, I'm considering doing a P.O. box, so I want to get you guys' opinion on that. If you guys think I should get a P.O. box or what. Um, so you guys can just comment down below in the comment section. Or you can message me about it and not message me but like comment on Instagram at Snapshot Babies Nursery what you guys think about that and this shirt right here this Mickey Mouse sweater thing is a size 0 to 3 months let's see just get it off your head Bubba I did do his hair a couple days ago but I figured I'll enjoy it while it still looks nice and then I'll do the changing video because I completely forgot that I needed to change him first. <laughs> but that's okay. We can always redo the baby's hair, right? Look how cute Mr. JJ is. Alright. I really think I just want to put the Sesame Street pants on. Let's just put the pants on first. Yeah, if you guys have any um, videos you would like to see with any of my babies, just let me know. I did just get a couple new ones, so you guys have to check out my channel for that. And I also still have some babies up for sale, so if you guys are interested in that, go to Instagram or check uh, my previous YouTube videos, all the babies featured and the videos are still available. Um, I am open to offers, but again, I am only selling through Instagram at the moment. I will not be doing any trades, so please don't ask if I will trade. 
But anyway, oh my gosh, I can tell he's just gonna look so cute in this outfit. All right, Sesame Street. Sorry, I forgot to get the tag out. All right, Mr. JJ. And this outfit here is a size 12 months. He can fit the um, 12 month size pajamas. Not necessarily the clothing, um, like pants and shirts and stuff like that, but he can for sure fit um, like the tight pajamas and things of that nature, which I think is awesome. And he can fit a large newborn onesie, um, but mostly zero to three months is his size. I can get this underneath them. There we go. And also Braxton can wear um, the size 12 months pajamas if you guys watched that video. So these two big boys can wear share the little PJs. But here's my cute little man. All changed and ready for the night. I'll bring you guys a little closer. There's my cute pie. Say hi, JJ. All right, guys. So I'm going to set Mr. JJ off to the side and get Miss McKenna all changed up. Let me see. Uh, I guess he wants to stand up for you guys. <laughs> you have to look this way, Bubba. All right. Sorry for all the wiggling. But, there we go, Miss McKenna Kenna. And I have not changed Miss McKenna since the Rose Show. So, some of you guys are probably wondering about that. This is my big girl here. I'm trying to get her situated for you guys so you can see her. Her hair is a mess, so don't mind her hair. <laughs> Alright, I just love this sweater. This sweater I got from, um, where did I get this from? Uh, Bye Bye Baby. I got it from Bye Bye Baby on the sell section. And I figured, you know, it's just a sweater, so she can wear something underneath it. Here's her little shoes, her gladiators, which are my absolute favorite. Get these pants off of her. And these pants actually go with a different shirt. And she is full limbed, just like JJ over there. And she wears size like zero to three months as well, if you guys are wondering. This, these pants are by Juicy Couture. So if you go back in one of my videos, you'll see like a haul that I did. And it features that. I'm going to be changing her. <clears throat> Don't mind her wild hair. <laughs> I'm going to be changing Miss McKenna here into this outfit here. I know it's like a little bit warm out today. And even though I just changed him into like a full set, but he's going to be ready for bed. And I just thought this outfit was really cute. <clears throat> so, oh, I said this is zero to three months. This is a size newborn, but it fits her like very perfectly. I think it would be too big for a doll that is newborn size, to be honest. Can you say hi to everybody, Miss McKenna? Alright, and if you guys are wondering where I got this bracelet, I got this also at the Rose Doll Show. <clears throat> and the outfit I'm getting ready to put her in is a size um, Carter's Six Months, which I didn't mention before. So this is a shirt here. I thought it was a onesie, but it's not. And that is okay. Um, I don't have a diaper on her because she has um, 
a bottom that is just like she doesn't need it <laughs> but she did have a um a diaper on but in order for those pants to fit i um took them off of her plus some for some outfits i feel like she needs the diaper but for some other outfits i feel like she looks better without it because it looks like she has a diaper on even though she doesn't so we'll kind of see what happens um, with this outfit if it looks like she might need a diaper or not so the shirt could honestly just be like a onesie on her which would have been cool because look maybe if I just add a couple buttons snap <laughs> But anyway, her arms sometimes like get stuck behind her, which is okay. Time for the overalls. All right, I'm just gonna go up and over. I feel like that would just be easier. I know this video is going to be pretty long because I'm changing two babies, but I figured, hey, why not? People have been requesting to see both these guys, so I decided to make a longer video. And I don't know if I would like this outfit on her, but I'm really liking it. I'm not going to do their hair since the video is already long enough. But, if you guys got through this video, I appreciate you guys um, sticking through and keeping up with my channel and watching all the whole video, even though this time is kind of boring because I didn't play any music. So, maybe next video I will play some music for you guys actually gonna put this back on her head so I like that on her it actually looked really cute on her uh oh if I can get it to there we go Miss Cutie Pie Miss McKenna and these are fake um, pockets I'm also gonna put these gladiators back on her feet because they are so cute And don't forget, as I mentioned earlier, to check us out on Instagram, Snapshot Babies Nursery. Check out the babies I have for sale. And also, um, I just post a little bit more on Instagram that I do on YouTube. And also, if you guys want to see anything, any type of videos, just comment down below. And I will be make sure I can get to that for you guys. And let's prop Miss McKenna back up. Uh oh, there goes her headband. But we can fix that later. So, there is the two babies for you guys. And thank you guys for tuning in and watching. And until next time, bye.